Hello, this is e Reviews, and I'm going to be showing you some solutions to some problems people had with my other video on how to sync music onto your iPod or iPhone without using iTunes. And if you haven't seen that video already, check that out now. And if you have a problem with that, then come back to this video, and I've got some fixes to some of the problems you may have. So, um, like I said in the other video, you need to get the f uh, install file for it. And if that doesn't open, if you have problems with it uh, installing, then try. Uh, try this out so you right click on the uh, file go down to properties and once it's open go up to compatibility and check run this program as administrator uh, once you check that you just click ok and hopefully the next time you open it um, it, it should let you install it as normal and the other problem the main problem people had was when they go into copy trans manager uh, and it says it's safe to connect your iPod when they connect it nothing would nothing would come up none of the songs or anything would come up and the reason for that is because there's no drivers to detect your iPod because you need the you need iTunes to detect um, your iPod so I've found a way to just get the drivers and not having to install iTunes so what you need to do is download the file uh, this file right here that says copy trans drivers installer I've got to I've got a link to that download in the description and once you download that you want to open it up alright so once it's open this will pop up and uh, in the bottom left corner you want to check this box, box here and then you need to click on automatic install and once you click that it will install the drivers and it will only take a couple of minutes and once it's done uh, the next time you actually go into the copy trans control center and open up uh, copy trans manager right there and once you open it up you can connect your iPod when it says it's safe to connect it and it will show up with the songs so I'll just demonstrate this for you now alright so now copy trans manager is opened up so I'm just gonna close this pop up here and now it says it's safe to connect my iPod so now I'm gonna connect it after I've installed the drivers so I'm just gonna connect it now and in a sec here um, all the songs on my iPod should come up Alright, so all the songs on my iPod have now popped up after installing the drivers. Uh, so hopefully that fixed the problem with people's iPods not being detected by copy trans. And the other problem people might have is when they drag the song in, like I showed in my other video, when you drag the song in, what you have to do is you have to actually click update here at the top. And if you don't press that, that the music on your iPod won't actually pop up. So you have to press update and it'll quickly sync the music onto your iPod. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the solution to some of the problems people had uh, with uh, how to sync music with our iTunes video. So yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment, and I'll see you in the next video.